Here we are in Mixcraft and we're going to load a new project. But this time we're choosing option 2 which is build loop and beat matched music. First thing we want to do is load a new sound. So I'm going to minimize this window and go and drag a new sound into Mixcraft. Again you see this prompt that says use best sounding project tempo. This time we're going to select yes. Now let's make a note that our tempo that it's going to switch to is 125 BPM. Click yes. If you're not already in your project tab, go there. Make sure that your metronome is on. And I'm going to turn the volume down a little bit on track one so that we can hear the song and the metronome at the same time. Make sure you rewind to the beginning and push play. Obviously you can hear that the metronome and the beat is not matched. So let's fix that. Go up to your sound and double click it or you can go down to your project details window and click the sound tab. Now if you go down here where it says detect the tempo, Mixcraft detected the tempo as being 125.2798 BPMs. Obviously that is not true based on what we heard against the metronome. So there's a couple of things we need to do first. One is that I'm going to go over here to the details window and I'm going to zoom in and the first thing you'll notice is this red arrow, vertical arrow. This is your snap point meaning that if snapping is turned on in Mixcraft and you manipulate the sound back and forth on your timeline it will snap to this point that you see by this snap point marker. Let's zoom in on the timeline for a second. So if I drag this you can see that it snaps to the next quarter note. Now if we were looking zoomed out like this, you wouldn't know that it wasn't right on the first beat. Zooming in I can see that. So I'm going to take this and move it all the way to the beginning of the beat. Now it snaps right to the beginning of the beat. Again it may be a little bit hard to see. Let me adjust this to some kind of random place, like in here. Now up here you can see that it is moved and now if I start snapping see how it snaps to the next quarter note where the arrow is, the red arrow. So let's go back and reset this all the way to the start. Now I've dragged it all the way back to the beginning and it snapped there. Now if you want to adjust snapping again just go up to the snapping drop down menu here and you can set what parameters of snapping that you want. So what we need to do is identify the tempo. The easiest way to do this is using some sort of tap tempo tool and you can find a whole bunch of them online. I have one on my iPhone that I use. To use one of these programs let's first turn the metronome off and then play the beat and tap it into our tap tempo tool. Okay, so my tap tempo tool here says 120 BPMs. So I'm going to go back to my sound and under adjust to project tempo, I'm going to adjust this to 120 BPMs. And let's arm the metronome, rewind and play. Now we're in perfect sync with our project tempo. Now when you're importing loops or sounds or songs, you'll often find that as much as Mixcraft tries, it doesn't always get the tempo right. And that's nothing bad against Mixcraft, that's just the nature of the beast. So let's load a new sound and see what happens with that one. I'm going to load Dance 01. Drag this all the way to the beginning. 
I'm going to select it, make sure it's selected, go down here to my sound details window. I'm going to zoom in. And again, I see that my snap marker is, I mean, it's almost exactly there, but just to make sure, I'm going to drag it over to zero. I'm going to rewind, mute track one, go over to project, turn on my metronome, and play it. Okay, that is obviously not what I wanted. So let's go back to our sound detail tab. If you notice here, the detected tempo was 59.9947 BPMs. And obviously it is not. Mixcraft, knowing that this would happen sometimes, has put in a nice little feature, which is this button right next to the tempo, which is the double or half current tempo. And I would say that this is pretty much half the current tempo. That's why it's playing so fast. So I'm going to double that by clicking the button. I'm now at 119.9894. Let's see how close that got us. Getting going to turn down the sound a little bit so we hear our metronome and push play. That's pretty darn good. Mixcraft did well.